I apologize. No makeup. Um, if it makes you run because I'm not wearing makeup and you want this picture perfect YouTube facade. Yeah, I don't give it. I don't have that life and I don't even want to pretend about it. Because I know firsthand it makes me feel like shit that I don't have that life and that all these other YouTubers, influencers, and I hate that term influencers. God. Well, it's not a title I'd ever want. Put it that way. So, if you hear my children playing outside, I apologize. We went to Target today and we, um, they got some Nerf guns, so they're outside playing with Daddy, having fun. So this is gonna be a weird er video for me. Um, it's actually gonna be a chit chat, and I think I'm gonna sneak a uh, sneak a giveaway into this. Well, not really sneak. I'll probably put it in the title. So, because I have such a few of you that watch my videos, to, to be honest, I'm not a huge following. I'm not one of the well liked. Um, YouTubers in my little community. I'm kind of like the little oddball that just stays off to the side. <laughs> Which, I get that. I do my best to support all my other small channels and friends that I've created along this journey thus far, but grad school has been hell and work has been, it's been terrible. Um, so I'm here to just give you guys like a little update, talk to you about some things going on in my crazy life, and then show you the items in the giveaway. So first off, biggest thing in my life so um, that has happened, my knee replacement is now scheduled for May 10th. I got the call the other day. So May 9th is Mother's Day and it's Logan's birthday. If you guys don't know who Logan is, that is my baby baby who will be two on May 9th. He is also the one that had transposition of the great arteries. He is the one who had um, Early, uh, tracheomalacia and tracheoesophageal fistula, which tracheomalacia means your airway like collapses, collapses and can't stay open. It's not um, strong enough, so his is pexy to a spinal column. And the fistula means that they were connected. He had a connection between his esophagus and trachea, so he's endured a lot. But I get to share my Mother's Day with him, which wouldn't change it any other way. Let's be honest, there. They give me my reason to keep going. I uh, got into my car accident like three weeks after we got back from having her. Three weeks back after Logan's hospital stay. I had him, but he was admitted and he had open heart surgery. So we were in Boston Children's for a while. But they're my reason. They were keep me going, especially like with the car accident. There are often days where I'm just like, I don't wanna continue. I don't know what the hell's the point. I'm not needed. Honestly, what impact do I have on anyone's life? Because, let's be honest, it's not much. But they keep me going. And today was like the first time in like a really long time. I felt like a semi-normal 29, almost 30 year old. We went to Target, as I said. So I picked up a few things. Speaking about that, Kimmy, if you are watching this right, like tonight when it gets uploaded, I will be sending out your cactus cup. I saw something at Target that made me think of you, and I have to open the box to. I'm just gonna open the box again. I'm probably gonna put it in a new box and stick something else, a little surprise in there for you. Cause let's be honest, I love you guys. I really do. You guys, you guys keep me going. But yeah, today was like the first day in a while I felt like someone my age and not so insecure and it was like for the dumbest reason like mine is my cane which I don't know if you guys have ever seen my cane she she is an old lady she looks like a curtain cane is what I call her so this is my cane I know some of you guys think that I'm just lying about um my inability to get around but I was actually originally told that I, there was a fear that I was going to lose my leg initially after the car accident. And then I was told I would never be able to walk unassisted. And now they've changed it to I'll never be able to, or if, oh, they said I would never be able to walk. And then they changed it so I'd be able to walk unassisted, which I'm hoping after the knee replacement, this thing goes. Cause I, to be honest, I don't want to feel like this at such a young age. I really don't. 
sorry for the close up, I was putting my cane down. Um, but yes, I felt normal because I was, like I had my sunglasses, I was originally pushing the stroller and I had um, the diaper bag on. Which we got a new diaper bag, which, is it near me? Hold on. Sorry, this video is a whole bunch of randomness, but it also feels like it gives you a chance to know me a little better. So this is the Ipsy Gritsy diaper bag. So I was carrying this, had my t-shirt and leggings on, my sunglasses, the stroller, and I felt like I was finally my age again and not held back by my disability. Which, granted, I still had the cane. If I wasn't utilizing the cane to walk, I was putting my weight on the stroller to try to get around that way. So, I thought, sorry, that is Mr. Butters. Clearly, he has something to say. But yes, so this is my diaper bag. It is an itsy ritzy. I don't know if any of my fellow YouTube friends are mommies, but they are amazing. So, this is a Chelsea and Cole um, collaboration with them where it has the little studs. Um, we have a bigger one too, but as you can see, the bigger butters, be quiet. Sorry about that. The bigger one has like two zippers, just like this one, but one of them completely went off the track, and it doesn't. Um, it drives me nuts because of the like it has both zippers, like this one but because it's off the track, it makes it impossible. And the difference between the bigger one and this is that this one, even when it's zipped all the way down, it doesn't fold open flat like the bigger one does. And the bigger one we utilize for Logan when we have to go to Boston for those medical trips. And they're really expensive. I haven't found anyone locally who can fix it yet. This one was a hundred bucks. The bigger one was 150. I just, I don't have it. I don't know what else to do. But, so there's that. But I do love it. It has like little hearts. I don't know if they're polka dots, but if you can tell they're, they're hearts. But, <sighs> but my new replacement is for May 10th. My is a little scattered. I'll probably be in the hospital for they said two to three days at least could be more depending on the severity and how how things go which i'm obviously really nervous about i gotta set money aside to try to get those foot peels my feet are already like disgusting so i'm, I'm they're gonna be gross i need to get the little foot mass peels and hoping to be able to talk with you guys do it maybe i can do like a live and chat with you guys um during the, after the surgery, not during. I don't know why during me has some problems. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm really nervous. Um, I really don't know what to say. I just, I really wish this car accident never happened. Cause not only like me it's taken a lot out of, like my husband, my kids, there was a time where I was like so panicking that my husband was going to leave me because of how much care I needed. We'd only been married for a little over a year, and I am requiring him to assist me with things that people don't normally have to assist their spouses until like 30, 40 years down the road. But he's been amazing and stood by me and took care of the kids, takes care of me. He has so much on his plate. I don't think he'll ever realize how much I love him. Even though we don't say I love you. In this household, we say it very many different ways, depending on who we're talking to. Um, my husband, I say I love him to the fridge and back. Um, his aunt actually got us a sign for our wedding that we have hung in the kitchen. I said I love you to the fridge and back. Devin, he says, I love you a lot in the middle. Which, Ryan would just say I love you a lot. That's what Ryan says. But Devin wants to add, he wants to have that one little step up. So he says, I love you a lot and a little. <laughs> Such a goof. But, alright, let's be honest. You guys are just watching for the giveaway. You really don't want to know all this craziness going on in my life that's not put together and 
but I hope some of you do appreciate the fact that I try to be honest and never pretend to be someone I'm not. But giveaway time for those of you who have subscribed and supported me and made me happy. You have no idea. There's some of you like who watch my videos. Like I have my Fab Fit Fun unboxing up, my original one. And there's a few of you, like, I'm still waiting for you to comment. Like, I know you're going to watch it. And it just, when you guys comment and interact with me, I get so excited. <laughs> it's pathetic. I love you guys more than you know. So, giveaway. Alrighty. I apologize. This is more of, like, a makeup feminine box. I do know I have a few male subscribers, like my buddy Chuck. But Chuck feel free to enter it could always help your ebay business if you guys don't know chuck um he comments in most of my videos check him out he is a very awesome reseller and then every now and then angie she's also a reseller will comment in but at least um but she is a female so she probably could benefit from some of this stuff so the first thing is i ended up getting a 15 day trial of Riverall for um, sensitive skin and it comes with a uh, gel cleanser and a moisturizer but yep so there's there's that and then there is brush guards so when you wash your brushes you can uh, help them keep them shape their shape while they dry sorry the kids are being loud they're getting ready to come in I might just pause for a minute and come back so I probably I apologize for the cut that's probably about to happen but I think they're getting oh maybe not I think they're gonna they're continuing getting on me a few more minutes but if they do come in I will pause and then come back um these are the say reusable rounds I do have a set of these and I do love them um the next off tropic eyeshadow palette let's see if i can get yeah, it's sealed right there so completely sealed and there are the colors a rose water setting spray lark and eve's um hair scarves i do have mine i use mine for like um like purse Decor, not what I'm trying to say, but I tie them in my purse like a purse ribbon. And I, I do like them though. I'm not talented enough to use them in my hair. This is a Revlon. That's a dub eyeshadow quad. This is a KVD. Um, actually, it says Cap on D. Um, Inkwell liner in the shade Lolita. So it is a colored liquid eyeliner. Um, let me see if I can pop it up without breaking the box for you guys. I don't want to break anything. There we go. The faces I make when I try to open stuff. I apologize. So there's that as a nice matte packaging. It's really beautiful. I just won't utilize it so I really would like to pass it on to you one of my friends which you guys are my friends i don't have a word to describe you well like i know some people have like names for their families but if you guys have one you think we should use it let me know i'd be more than happy to this is a smashbox trio in the name holy crop Yes, I'm easily entertained that way. This is a Revlon Colorstay Brow Fiber Filler. This isn't a brown shade. If you guys cannot utilize it, feel free to pass it on, give it away. And you know, one of your giveaways for my YouTube friends or donate whatever you feel like doing. I have another thing of Paradox um, Los Angeles patches. These were included in my last giveaway as well. This is the Billion Dollar Brow Clear Brow Gel. So if you can't use the got that. This is Glow and, uh, Glow Skin Beauty Anti-Stress CBD Drops. 
these are rather expensive, but I received them in a box and I haven't utilized them. And it's been about a month since I've had them, so I'd rather just pass them on to someone who will use them. Um, this is a power brush to wash your face. It says gently eliminate bacteria causing acne. It has two speeds, brush heads, the batteries are included, and it comes with a travel bag. So there's that. This is a Tristique Eye Duo Good Vibes Mascara and Eye Pencil. This is sealed, so I will not, no, it's not sealed, hold on, let me see. Yeah, no, there's no way I can get that open, so I'm not even going to try. There is the, this is a cult favorite, and I know a lot of people love it, which is why I purchased it to put it in this giveaway. This is the Tarte C drink of H2O. And lastly, a brush set. So I have a lot of brushes and then it comes to like this pouch to carry them all in. So that's what is in my giveaway. So what are the rules? There gotta be rules. Um, first off, YouTube is not, or any of the brands mentioned, not affiliated with this thing, this giveaway. Um, must be an age or older. Due to my current financial struggles, it has got to be a US only. If you are outside of the US and you do win, please just have a US address you'd like to ship it to or a US friend who you would like to ship it to. This giveaway will run until Easter at 12, which I believe is 4-4. Um, so I believe it's August 4th fairly certain on that. If I am wrong and it's not, that's not the date Easter falls on, I will correct it. But so it'll end on 4-4 at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, because that is my time zone. To enter this giveaway, I want to make it for people to actually watch me. Sneak in the word knee replacement. Because <laughs> that is what my life revolves around right now. And I will pick a winner on Easter evening and upload it and let you guys and ship it out to you for you guys to enjoy. So it's like your own little Easter present even if you don't celebrate Easter or you feel like you're too old to have your own little Easter basket, this can be your Easter basket for me because I truly love all of you. But all right, until next time guys, stay happy, stay safe, stay healthy. Oh, like, subscribe too. <laughs> all right, love you all. Bye.